हेलो ऑल ऑफ यू वेलकम टू ट्यूटोरियल ऑन प्राइमरी की एंड फॉरेन की नो इन डी बी एम एस एंड एस क्यू एल प्राइमरी की एंड फॉरन की आर वेरी आइडेंटिकल एंड देयर फॉर देर आर लॉट ऑफ इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन विच आर आस्ड ऑन द बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ प्राइमरी की एंड हाउ इट इज रिलेटेड टू फॉरन की टू स्टार्ट विद प्राइमरी की इज अ कैंडिडेट की with no null values primary key is a candidate key with no null values no. candidate key is any key which with the help of which we are able to uniquely identify a record of a table that means we are able to uniquely identify a record of the table with the help of candidate key and that candidate key should not have any null values in it that means the records of that particular candidate key should not be void or empty let's take an example of table 1 that is department let the department table have 3 attributes the first attribute is department id department name and the address of the department let me fill the values of the table let the department id be d1 d2 d3 d4 and so on let the department name be some x y z a b c p q r x y z a let the address be some random address values now for this particular table department table let us say that department id is the primary key now if department id is the primary key each record in the department id attribute should be unique which is unique and there should be no null values in this department id which holds in this particular case now foreign key is identical to primary key since foreign key is basically a reference of primary key into some other table first let us take an example and then we'll go to the definition of what a foreign key is let us consider another table with table name as table name as employee now let us define the attributes of the table employee employee id employee name address of the employee and the department to which the employee belongs that is department id now consider consider table 1 again the department table had three attributes mentioning department id department name and address of the department employee table has four attributes referring to employee id the name of the employee the address where employee stays and the department in which the employee works let me fill some values some random values in this table let the address be some random values again just to understand the concept of primary key and foreign key let uh, let us fill any random data into it now if we are considering that these two tables are being referenced that means this that means this department id is being referenced into this table as department id again let us say that employee e1 works in the department d1 employee e2 also works in department d1 
employ E3 works in department D3 and D4 for E4 since uh, department ID is being referenced from another table that is the department table this department ID in employee table is known as the foreign key also the rule is that that the foreign key of any table should be the primary key in the reference table that means whatever foreign key in this table is there that is department id it should be the primary key of the table which is which it is being referenced to that is department id was the primary key which we had already mentioned now this is the concept of primary key and foreign key to know the differences between primary key and foreign key please refer to the next video